James with the dust firmly settled on Leicester. Um, what have the takeaways been this week in training? I know you weren't involved watching from the stands. Yeah, look, I think we just need to pick our accuracy up a little bit. We're uh, we're a bit guilty of you know pushing the pass a little bit, trying to trying to offload when we don't need to, and, and not holding on the ball, not treasuring possession. So certainly something we've spoken about this week, and uh, we know we know we need to do against a, a very potent uh, Newcastle side. And, and unfortunately for yourself, you've been out of the team for a little while, came back and we played Saints. But um, what have you made of the younger lads who have pushed on in that time? Stan Sal, someone who's in your position, has seemed to have done really well. Recently. Yeah, we've had some great guys step up. You know, obviously we've been uh, you know with internationals and a few injuries. We've had some guys that, are, that have played a lot of rugby when they probably weren't expecting to, and I think it's, uh, it's been fantastic for their development. They've really put their hand up and made selection tough for, uh, for the bosses. So that's what we want. We want guys continually to put their hands up for uh, you know week in week out and I think it's uh, you know it's only going to be you know help the development of the squad and for them individually today we're down at St John's school in Leatherhead is it nice to sort of get out of the uh, the training ground every now and again come down I suppose different environment and you, you, know, you get to put smiles on faces as well yeah yeah so sort of, I think you hit the nail on the head there it's sort of nice to get out of the environment do something a bit different um, you know some great facilities here there's some great schools around our region so it's uh, it's nice to get out and uh, experience that and the kids seem to like it and the school like having us here so uh, we very much appreciate their hospitality. With this week we've got Falcons at home back at the stoop in front of what's hopefully going to be a, a sellout crowd. How much of a role do the do the supporters have to play in, in a game like this? Obviously last game we had at, uh, at the stoop we didn't put a performance in that we're proud of and we need to we need to make it up to our supporters it's uh you know they're you know they're the lifeblood of this this club and we need to make sure that we do everything we can to make them proud and uh you know i'm, I'm going to show you we're doing everything we can to get the, to get the result and uh, put a smile on their face come saturday afternoon